Okay, so now we're going to make the pencil car. So I start out this pretty much the same way. What I want to do though is I want to start out putting in my, my axle holes. So I go up to six and I come back to anywhere between um, nine and fifty here. Come from the front of the car back anywhere between nine and fifty. Draw my circles for my axles. Draw this circle. And then I do the push pull. And I do the push pull. If I would have wanted to cut my car shorter, I would have done that as well. Just kind of figured out what the front of my car was going to be. Edit, delete guides. Now when it now is where it comes to a different thought of how I'm going to work with this. Now I want to go to step three so I can get my CO2 cartridge there. But I have to hold my axles somehow. So I'm going to draw what I'm going to hold my axles with, first of all. So whether it's an arc. Oop. So I'm going to do an arc here. Bring it up over my axle. And we're going to do an arc back here, or up front here. That's going to go over my axle. So you could do that in whatever shape you want. You just got to make sure to have material underneath the axle holes. Okay? Now, we're actually going to erase this surface. So we're going to use the eraser to get rid of these corners. Okay, and then I can do my push-pull with my axle holes going back. Oh, I forgot to hit option in the last one. When I'm push-pulling, I want to hit the option key again. Push-pull, option. And now I have this basic part. Now I have to come up with what I want for around my CO2 cartridge to hold that CO2 cartridge. So I just have to stay three millimeters away and I'm going to bring mine down the green axis here. Come straight down. Come back on the green axis. I'm three millimeters away. It filled in. Okay. Push pull that. Push pull that. And we now kind of had the beginning of what that's going to look like. Okay? So I got to go three millimeters out past the end. So I'm going to push pull this again and hit the to get it out to that three millimeter point. And I can draw a line across here to fill this in. Now I have to decide the shape that I want to go down to here. I want that pencil shape, so I'm going to do a small arc. Remember, I'm doing half of it here. And then I'm going to draw a line from here to an edge here. And I want it to come into about down here. Okay? And this is where we're using a new tool. It's called Follow Me. Follow Me goes, click on the surface just like you would for a push pull, but now you can make it go down that line. Now I want to bring it all the way in. I can bring it to there. Then I can finish it out with the push pull. If 
try out the option key if you got to try out the option key. Then I can erase what I don't need. Erase this top surface here, erase these bottom surfaces. And here's the beginning of, here's the pencil car. This one does look like a vacuum cleaner. You have to connect these here, you have to connect, so you just have to figure out the shape you want to connect these. So I just draw on the bottom of here, and I push pull that down to connect them. It isn't really that hard to make it. Because if I go here, ortho printing, I'm going to cut all of this out with a saw. And then you cut all of this out with a saw. So really, you only have a little bit of sanding to touch it up and make it look good. So do I, can I still make it shorter? Yep, you can still make it shorter. Okay? Thank you. Yep.